All right, this is a quick video on importing an Excel file into Jamovi. Um, I'm going to use this data in future videos. So first, what you would need to do is go to the little three lines um, to the top left here. And I'm going to say special import. And it might just say import depending on your version. I'm not positive about that, but it might say that. Um, and I can browse and then it, you can't see this in the video, but I'm going to um, open this from my, uh, from my computer. So you just select your file. I do wanna note that if you download a Google Sheets file to your computer, um, it downloads as Excel. And this is a super weird quirk that's been here for a while. But if you try and open it um, in Jamovi, it won't recognize it. So you actually have to open the Excel file on your computer and then just save it. And then it'll let you open it. And I have no explanation for you. Um, so what this is, what you're going to notice is that um, because there's these like three variables that always show up when you open Jamovi, you actually just need to delete them. So I can right click on them I can right click on the column and I can say delete variable. Okay. Um, I could do them together, delete variables, okay. And so you can see here that um, this uploaded as numbers. I don't see any little A's on the bottom for alphanumeric. This is the narcissistic personality inventory. And you can see that there are lots of um, questions. And so, oh. Got a weird notation in there. Um, and I also have a total score here. I'm actually going to delete that because we're going to create a total <laughs> uh, in a future video. So I'm going to delete that. And this is just a um, data set here. So you would want to go through and then make edits to it. Um, participant, there actually is an ID option for your variable type. So I would want to change that. Um, you could add labels, but that is essentially how you um, import an Excel file. And then you would just go ahead and save it. So I would say save, and I'm going to call this um, my NPI underscore uh, 8, 14, 2022. And oh, no, 2023, save. And there you go. That's how you import an Excel file.